Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Another episode of Laser Dry Fire. I'm using the Dry Fire Online camera app, which you see right here, which is my uh, iPad, but any iOS device, as far as I know. Um, so I made a new I made a new stage. It's based off an existing stage. Uh, let's, let's go over it real quick. I think I called it. Uh, I already have my shift point of impact. I zeroed in my laser, and this is not uh, too. F the distance is not too far. Screen size is 28 inches at 1.5 yards. Very close, but we'll be using the mantis, the mantis black beard. That's what I'm going to be using today. <laughs> Love using this thing. Uh, hopefully it will stay functional. Mantis Blackbeard, that's the battery. That's the bolt. This is also part of it. So anyways, so it's called El Presidente at 30 feet. Um, but I modified it, and you're going to see it. So let's start the stage. And before I continue, um, I'm not sure if James Bond AR-15 is still a usable coupon code, but you can give it a try. I encourage you to sign up. All right, sign up, sign in, and start building your own stage. Uh, expert subscription gives you 50 rounds. I wish you can do more. I wish you can choose the amount of rounds you can do, but anyways, let's get started, and I'll explain it to you. All right, starting. All right. Safety check. Let's do a safety check. All right, I've already safety checked it. This is my red dot, my pistol, AR pistol that is. Uh, battery, so there's nothing in there. Here is the Blackbeard, Mance's Blackbeard. It's part of the whole thing. There's no way I can charge anything. So yes, safety checked, that's checked. All right. Don't be that guy. Confirm the gun is unloaded. All right. All right. When you hear that sound, that's good. Let's get ready. All right. Let's just go ahead and just push continue. All right. So here it is. I got 60 seconds to do this. These are still targets. They're all at the same yardage. Or different yardage. Anyways, they're layered, so I don't know how many they are. I could kind of tell the right is a little bit smaller, so that may be less. There's supposed to be five, but it's random. All right, so I'm shooting a still target. It disappears. Behind it is a random target, either a bad guy with a gun, which you would you would hit, right? So you try to hit for center mass. And then I go on to the next one. And this is not only trigger speed, but, you know, I, I do work on trigger speed, but also, you know, there's a lot of things that happen and it's not about how fast you can go per se. It's about seeing what's in front of you as well. So that's what I'm trying to do with this stage that I built. So it's El Presidente, kind of, but it's not El Presidente. I just based it off of that stage. And then it's an existing stage that I modified to do what I wanted to. All right. Okay. So here's the thing. It's random the amount of steel targets in front of the random cardboard targets that they're either a pistol which would be a bad guy hands up or a star which would be the sheriff don't shoot the sheriff so i don't know how many white steel targets are in front of that so that's why i can't just you know start shooting away i have to be very careful and then once i get to the cardboard targets i have to see what's there and either make a decision so i have to stop so if you look at my splits you can see i hit zero zeros are where where i hit center mass but i didn't do an ouch 
That's the important thing, no ouch. And I gave myself 20, about 20 seconds for a round. Here's my splits. I didn't miss, no ouch. No misses, no ouch. That's the point, right? Ouch on that. So again, I set it up. I know there's about five. Well, I know there's five, but it's random. So there could be five. There could be one. There could be three. There could be two. I haven't had you know, it's all random, so there could be none, right? You know, the, the cardboard target will just show up. So I did an oops, shot too many times, got a little trigger happy. So this is a different kind of trigger control. I guess you could say this is a different trigger control. I don't know what else you would say. All right, so uh, let me time out, <laughs> let it time out. Let's do a couple more and let's have some fun, all right? And I. The AR pistol was, <laughs> the only good AR pistol is a training AR pistol. I wouldn't take this into battle uh, unless it was the last pistol on earth, then yeah, I would, but uh, but good for training for laser dry firing. Get that AR trigger pull, you know. All right, let's get started. So you can kind of see my splits. You can see what I'm doing is I'm judging, you know, the steel targets, maybe because of the size. Is there one steel target? Is there two? Um, and then as soon as the cardboard is revealed, I got to make a split decision. Shoot or don't shoot, right? So, and then obviously you see your splits on the right side. So I'll let this time out again, and uh, we'll do a couple more. And I, I, I think this is a pretty good stage. As, I like as much as I like to just, you know. It's not always like that, you know. So you got to be very selective of your shots. I'm assuming you got to be selective of your shots, especially if you're not, you know, have any immunity. You're just a regular civilian. See, that's what I'm talking about. I shot the sheriff, but I didn't shoot the deputy. <laughs> So that's the stage I built. Feel free to copy this stage. Um, I'm not really part of a community. I don't do Facebook. I don't do Instagram. Uh, YouTube is about all I do. Uh, if you, I don't know if I can share this in any way, but obviously you can copy it. It's not that hard. It, it was a little difficult to, 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 to do because I had to layer it on top of each other without having it the sides kind of layered outwards. It's kind of weird. Anyways, uh, do I have time for one more? Let's do one more. Last one. All right. Let's make it a good one. Right. I guess it was a good one. Nobody. Nobody. Okay. At least I hit my steel targets, but I didn't go fast. I, sh I just enough just to get to the cardboard and then stop. All right, shoot or don't shoot. So anyways, if you like this type of video, please like, share, comment, and subscribe for more of these type of videos. Till next time, bye-bye.